In the second use case, we will predict the location of slums in Lagos using remote sensing and other spatial data sites. Before we proceed, let us briefly describe random forest, which is our classifier algorithm for this second use case, and also look at our data set. Random forest is a machine learning algorithm. It builds a forest based on multiple decision trees and then match them together, whereby so as to get a more accurate and stable prediction. An advantage of using random forest is that it's, um, it can deal with different data types as well as, well as large data sets. We can also use random forest for classification or regression problems. It's also very easy to use. In our own and on exercise, we will use random forest to classify if a particular pixel is a slum or not based on the identified drivers and their importance. So now let us briefly describe our data set. As mentioned earlier, our study area is still Lagos in Nigeria. Our data set include survey derived data of slum and non-slum which we are going to use to train our model. We also have remote sense data, which, is, which includes slope and digital elevation model. We also have distance related generated data set, such as distance to road, water, religious center, markets, and dump sites. All our rest of data sets are in 30 meter resolution. So now let us go to QGIS where we prepare our data for further analysis.